Okay, welcome back to the car hole. We're uh, doing a wheel bearing today, but it's just not that hard because we got the whole spindle because they didn't want to pay extra more money. So we just got a spindle from Pickup Pole. So this one's making noise. And it makes some weird chattering on it. I grabbed this, so that should fix problems. Uh, this spins whew, way more better. I mean, it sounds like, yeah, it's good. Don't worry, it's good. Uh, I already checked it. It's, at least it's better than what's on there. So, may as well fix that because your list gets long and then maybe change that and a couple of other things. That's what I'm doing. So, if you want to watch me do that, then do it. If not, well, then Ooh, that sounded weird. That should be good, eh? Yep. Bong! Blazing that! Okay. Oh. Whoa! Oh, that's not good. No, no, no. Okay, hang on a second. How would that wheel do that? Okay, we'll take it off gently. Oh, no. Okay. We gotta put that back on there. <laughs> she's a little, uh, she's not quite sitting on much there. Oh, yeah. Okay. She had, we almost had a little flop over. See, I used some 4x4s. Four four oh, so obviously I shouldn't have done that. So let's just readjust our situation. Oh, underhand. Oh. Make sure you have your beverage of choice while you're watching. And I get to have mine too while I'm working. So it's the best of both worlds. Words. Worlds? Worlds. Words. You, you want to look? Okay. Figured you would. Get this off first, obviously. And then get that broken. The impact. And this will come off. And then we'll do the tur rod. And then the bell joint. And the strut. This actually looks in good shape. Like, it's not terrible. And then our boot. That's just rust prevention from our leaky oil pump gasket and this boot looks okay too other than it's a little mangled looking but it's not broke so yeah. all right i'm gonna take this apart bingo oh magic so now you can hear hear that yeah that's dicked it's dicked Where's our other one here? Oh. Ah. Way more better. Way more better. Way more better. Way more better. Okay, so this ball joint is bad. So I'm just going to leave it. And then I'm going to use the ball joint that came with that one. Because it's equally as bad. I already bolted it on there. I mean, it's, yeah, it's about the same badness. So I forgot That's I fine. needed a nut. So now I gotta pull this off anyway. So this cotter pin. Oh man. Oh, damn it. I just broke. Oh, oh, oh. oh, oh, oh. Come on now. It's kind of like a loose tooth. Ha ha. Wee wee. Wee wee. Do do do. Do 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 do. Okay. I'll put that little guy back on there. And now I'll find the other one that's on the floor from the other one probably in about five minutes. Yeah, there it is. Mm. Of course. Come on. Oh yeah, uh, if you don't have a Romba for your garage, uh, you gotta get one. Because uh, this thing is, this thing oh, there. is sweet. Okay. She's kind of going now. Make your own. <sighs> yeah, they're halfway on there. Oh, I must have mushroomed it. Did I hammer smash that? Oh, darn it. Oh, okay, get rid of them. You always got to not have stuff in your hand when you're trying to do stuff. You ever do that? I do that. Let's just hold shit. Okay, I think it's on there. Let's just impact it. I think if we impact it on there. Cross threads better than no threads. All right, getting a real little blah, 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 wrapped up here. Oh, it's too small. Let's go, whoop. Okay. Get this, uh... okay, so uh, you're probably wondering uh, what the torque specs are for the wheel bearing here. So, uh, basically all of it. Perfect. 
Man. Oh, we got the wheel, uh, or the wheel. Get everything back on here. She's torqued to spec. She's actually a little snug here. Maybe I tightened it too much. Too many ugga duggas. Well, we'll uh, put the wheel on and then hey give it a spinner and see. And uh, see if that's good. She's a little stiff, so I don't know if I tighten that too much. All that mugga duggas on the torque on the old impact there, but we'll we'll be good. We'll be good. Uh uh. Yeah, so uh next thing on this turd is what are we doing next on this? Uh, oh, I'm gonna change the gear oil. Because we got a little bit of synchro jamage in fourth gear. And then you gotta kinda like baby it in. You want to see some dirty gear oil? No? Okay, well, I'm going to show you anyway. <laughs> Why are you wearing gloves, you pansy? Well, gear oil stinks, and I don't want any stinky, stinky stinks on my fingers. Because then when I'm eating my tacos later... Oh, that's actually really clean. Oh, shit. Look how clean that is. Why is it shifting so shitty? We're going to change it anyway. Oh, yeah. Can we get it? Oh, always undo the top fill one first. Interesting. Hmm. Well, that's fine. I already got the fluid. Oh, see that come out now better? That's like golden. Gee. That was a waste. I should actually put that in a different bottle. We got a little bit of synchro uh, grinding and going. But that's clean as all can be. I thought this was going to be a lot dirtier for 700,000K. Wow. I said this thing takes 4 liters. It seems like a lot. I don't think that's 4 liters in there. But that's fine. Maybe. Maybe not. There. Now I won't have stinky fingers. Oh, it stinks. Can you smell that? Oh. No. Oh, good thing you don't have smell vision. It might be a thing one day, you know. Who would have thunk? Nope. Oh, shit. Uh, oh, there's my scary man. Now can't hear shit.com. And then little stuff. I got a little thing for that. And then we got a new eyeball for this side because this has been patched over. Uh, that's about it, really. So, yeah. Uh, if you made it this far, the two of you that are still watching, then uh, dislike it, this video, and subscribe. Because then that way uh, I'll know what's happening. And then you'll get more shitty content as time goes on.